Our topic is bipolar disorder. Our meditation comes to us from Isaiah chapter 41 verse 9. You whom I have taken from the ends of the earth and called from its farthest regions and said to you, you are my servant. I have chosen you and I have not cast you away. My friends, is there any time you were troubled in true, two contradictory opinions? Is there any time you were troubled to take the right decision at a crucial moment? Is there any time you regretted your decisions? My brethren, what is bipolar disorder? It is an experience of different mood at the same time. It is an experience when a man hears or experiences two different kinds of voices. For example, you may be struggling between faith and fear, heaven and hell. It is like a Lavadician experiences, living in hot and cold at the same time. Obviously, one will be true and another will be a lie. When you get confused between these two, fear and anxiety will begin. People with bipolar disorder have extreme mood swings. They face depression and fear. Their thoughts will change all of a sudden. They are not one stable minded. The better practice to bring to control is good sleep, good lifestyle, exercise. But the best practice is to feel the presence of God in your life. You know, this chapter helps us to have few ways to control bipolar disorder. Number one, Isaiah 41 verse 12. Trust you do not have enemies. No negative thought. Let your thoughts be filled with positiveness. Control your mind just on possible things. Just imagine. Make up your mind. Reprogram your mind as if you don't have any enemies. Number two. 41 verse 13. Trust. God is your guide. God holds your hand. It is always better Jesus to hold our hands. Rather, we hold his hands. Because when trouble aggravated, we will take our hands off. So let God hold your hands. And number three, Isaiah 41 verse 17. Trust God is your sufficiency. Be content in all the ways. Learn to be satisfied with even if simple things are available. My friends, are you a person who smiles seldom? Are you the person who always moody? Are you struggling to mingle with the public and people? Here is the prophecy. Isaiah 41 verse 10. Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Let's pray. Dear Lord, many times we, we are suffering from bipolar disorder. Too many opinions at the same time. Sometimes we live in a confused state of mind. But please, dear Lord, help us to trust you that you are our God and you will make everything happen for us. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. God bless you.